fireworks on Capitol Hill as one of Rhode Island's U.S. Senators faced criticism for his priorities. 12 News Politics Editor Ted Nisi tells us about the exchange. Ted? Well, Shannon, there was plenty of local flavor in that exchange as former Massachusetts Governor Mitt Romney, now a U.S. Senator from Utah, took aim at Rhode Island Democrat Sheldon Whitehouse. What we do here is more uh, Barbie than it is Oppenheimer. Utah's Mitt Romney launching a blistering attack on Rhode Island's Sheldon Whitehouse over how Whitehouse is leading the U.S. Senate Budget Committee. The public thinks we work on the budget, but we don't. We've had 28 hearings before today. Do you know how many of those hearings have been on the budget? Two. White House became chairman of the Budget Committee last year, but he's drawn increasing criticism from Republicans for holding hearings on issues like abortion and climate change. Now I'm concerned about the climate, but 14 of our hearings have been on climate change. White House was having none of it. My God, if there is ever a crisis looming that we're not responding to that's going to smash into the budget, it's climate change. So I have no hesitancy about continuing to do that work. White House also noted the committee held a hearing just last week on health care costs, but Romney wasn't satisfied. Let us look at bipartisan ways we can reduce the massive cost of our health care spending in ways that do not cut benefits. I agree with you on climate change, Mr. Chairman, but 14 of 28 hearings are on climate change. Wait and the budget two on the budget. Blown out by it. The federal debt is currently about $27 trillion. Romney is pushing for Congress to create a bipartisan commission that would explore ways to bring that number down. Ted Nisi, 12 News.